Yeah, I think you ought to obviously want to go hard up front uh, against every single opponent. <clears throat> Sorry, but um, this is just a pure rotational. Um, you know, John Ray has flown a lot and he's played a lot. And um, I'll start for that matter as well. And even two weeks ago, I've already decided I'm going to give them a, a break. So, uh, I mean, I'm in a great position to have great players on the bench and that you can rotate. So, uh, obviously, you want to be physical. Uh, that's the way we play. But uh, the other two players are also physical players and you don't lose anything there. Well, I think it's, a, it's, a, it's a probably a 50-50 because uh, John Ray is very, very good in the lineouts, um, you know, and it's two different players, and each guy's got his own strengths, but, uh, you know, Flip as well is improving there as a, as a five jumper. He adds something extra in, in, the, in the malls, not probably one, we won't probably more in the next game, but uh, he adds something in the malls, and um, so, you know, what you lose in the lineout, you, you gain in, in, in other areas, it's also a great, uh, you know, a great cleaner and a great ball carrier, so... It's a great thing to have horses for courses, both great players, and uh, you know, John will start in future as well. <coughs> no, I think it's always tough playing the Wallabies. Um, you know, a lot of the times people underestimate the back of forwards. I, th- I thought they, will, they really played well against the British and Irish Lions. So uh, we know it's going to be physical. It's always physical, you know, be it Super Rugby or be it Test Match Rugby, it just goes a level up. So we always know it's going to be physical, and um, they are, you know, sometimes you'll think they're great attacking backs, but. Uh, you know, not, not that physical forwards, but, uh, you know, you, you and is a, is a great coach and uh, he believes in the set place, same that I believe in. So uh, I know the pack will improve and, like I said, our physical pack and uh, we, we expect a true physical answer. No, I don't think we, we go in the game like that. Uh, I've been very, very happy for discipline the last games. Um, that's one of the areas I've been really hard on and I think we've really improved. So uh, we just go out there to, you know, to play as physical as possible with inside the rules. And uh, there's a lot of other teams that uh, provoked us, but I think our guys have been, you know, been really disciplined up till now. And uh, we want to play positive rugby and focus on the positives and um, obviously play hard, but uh, you know, really concentrate on the game we want to play. And, and you need to be focused, you need to be clinical. There's no, no way you get uh, emotional and uh, you do simple things. You know, it's not going to win test matches. No, I think um, you know, I want to make too big, big a thing about it, but like I said, it's, it's a well-known fact It's always difficult playing away from home and you need experienced players that's play there and guys that's won there before so uh, you know Ron has played well he's been the informed guy you don't want to go into an unbelievable tough test match like this with guys that hasn't proven themselves you know Yard is still improving as a player and uh, I think he'll be great from the bench coming on but uh, you know Ron knows what he want to do he's been he's been playing a lot of test matches that we've won this year so uh, it was an easy choice to, to stick with him yeah, there's definitely you know, there's a perception of, of Zayn that uh, you know, he's only a kicking fullback, but like I said, if you look at all the teams he's played before, they scored, in, even in Super Rugby, almost close to the most tries. Last year, I think we scored uh, 22 tries, and the Wallabies scored 13 tries, and, and, and Zayn was the fullback. At Loftus, we scored five tries. I think he scored one once, unlucky not to, uh, it was a 50 50 decision. So if you look at the Super Rugby stats in the past, he's always been up there with the, with the, you know, with the guys that scores the most tries. So uh, I just think he's a clinical uh, uh, fullback. Uh, he can attack uh, if, if there's opportunity, and um, you know he can defend. He's a very, very good defender, very good other high ball. And you know you sometimes people read too much into rugby. Um, with the same back line, we scored I think nine tries against Argentina. The week later, we score one. So sometimes it works for you, and it just depends on the day which guy is playing. It's not to say you know it was the same in back played fullback. They said we we're going to score a lot of tries, and we didn't. So I think Zane is a, is a quality player, and uh, doesn't get a credit, and uh, he's always done well for credit.